Hey everybody, Pastor Kelly coming at you. A little short video here. And uh, no, that's not Pastor Kelly on your screen. That's a uh, convicted child molester, Jared Fogel. Why am I making a video of such a fellow? Well, it seems that uh, he seems to have gotten a secondary punishment in prison for his actions. I'm not saying it's right what happened to him. But I'm saying, if you dish out sin upon this earth, you will receive retribution for it. That is facts, folks. That is facts. The Bible says in Matthew 25, 40, it says, Verily I say unto you, Insomuch as you have done it unto one of the least of these, my brother, ye have done it unto me. Evidently, this may be possibly... Let's pray that the inmate that did this to Mr. Jared Fogle had been reading his Bible. Had Jared read his Bible, he would know Galatians 6-7 says, Be not deceived, God is not mocked. For whatsoever a man soweth, that shall he also reap. Looks to me like he's reaping the seeds of his uh, sinful discretions that he has committed against children. The the least of us, indefensible. I mean, this is, there's no defense for that. Had had he committed these crimes in certain other countries, he would have been put to death already, or at minimum had his genitalia removed or his hands removed. Now, am I advocating that? Well, for a child molester, yes, praise God, I guess I am advocating that. Well, it looks to me like that... Uh, at least a little bit of justice has been served in the prison system. You folks let me know what you think. As always, I'll be praying for you. You pray for me. We love you, but Jesus loves you more. Pastor Kelly is out of here.